Hey guys, welcome back. So get ready for the next level camera details with the upcoming iPhone 14 Pro models where this time Apple will be using a high megapixel main sensor to capture better details in photos and videos. Moreover, we'll take a look at some CAD renders which were leaked last week for the standard iPhone 14 and 14 Pro models. Now before we jump into the video, I wanna say that if you haven't subscribed to this channel, make sure to subscribe to get more daily updates and give a like if you enjoy watching this video so first of all here we have a sketch image with full detailed look at the design of the iPhone 14 Pro the first thing you will notice is the pill shape punch hole cutout on the front which is kind of bigger than we expected it does give a fresh look to the iPhone's display now again Apple will use this boxy design for all the upcoming iPhones which will be slightly thicker than the last year's iPhone 13 Pro also this time the camera bump is going to be even more bigger and the camera lens will be protruding more compared to the iPhone 13 Pro. And the reason behind a large camera bump is the latest 48 megapixel main camera which will make its first appearance this year in the Pro devices only. Now Apple will definitely utilize this sensor for more detailed photos and videos where nighttime images will see a significant improvement. No doubt Apple was already doing a great job with its 12 megapixel sensor size but the details were not that great when we zoom in. Samsung's 108 megapixel sensor is on another level level right now captures sharp and deep photos. It would be interesting to see how well Apple can optimize this latest 48 megapixel camera according to their taste. Now latest rumors also suggest that this new image sensor will also bring the insane level of 8K video recording option to the table and I'm already started feeling sorry for the storage because the 4K video already consuming so much space on our devices and imagine how much space this 8K video will take. Anyways, you guys let me know what are your expectations with this new 48 megapixel camera in the comment section. Talking about some more differences between both the standard and pro models, Apple will use two different CPUs this time, the Apple's A16 and A16 Pro Bionic chip. There will be a performance gap between both the CPUs where the A16 will offer similar power to Apple's A15 and the A16 Pro will be completely new chip based on 4nm fabrication means more powerful in CPU performance as well as in hardcore gaming. Now the reason behind using old chip with a new name is just for the marketing purpose and I hope at least with the standard models we'll see a little price cut at this time. So that is it in this video guys do let me know your thoughts in the comment section about the upcoming iPhone 14 series. If you enjoy watching this video then do give it a thumbs up and subscribe to this channel as well. I'll catch you in the next one till then peace out.